I got a fantastic question the other day about blacksmithing hammers. And the question went, hey, custom blacksmithing hammers are expensive as crap. Can I take a cheap hammer and dress the face and it do the same job? And the answer is wholeheartedly yes. Okay. The hammer that I use that I've had since I was 13 was a hammer that most likely came from Lowe's or Home Depot. It is nothing special. And it's lasted all these years. Hammers, as a rule, just don't tear up at all. That's why you can go to your local pawn shop and find dozens of hammerheads. The handles have long since rotted out, but the hammerhead itself is still pretty awesome. Now, here's the thing, and I... And I <laughs> I sell hammers. My hammers are $135 a piece. Most likely, you can go down to Lowe's and buy a really nice quality hammer of the same size for about 30 bucks. Why the price difference? Simply because I have to make the damn thing. I have to spend time in my shop, which is, for me, is more valuable than the time that they spent stamping them out at the factory. Now, is performance, are you going to get better performance out of my hammer than a hammer at Lowe's? Probably not. If they have both been tempered and hardened properly, which the factory ones almost always are, you're going to get the same life out of them. When you're buying a blacksmith's hammer, you're buying a blacksmith's hammer because it's the blacksmith that made it. It's the cool factor there. Now, I'm not saying it's not worth that. We spend a lot of time to make these things. But is it somehow a magical hammer of smithing plus one? Absolutely not. When you're just starting out, you can even go to the dreaded Harbor Freight and get a hammer, dress it up a little bit, and it's going to do you a great job. I don't think I have ever heard of a hammer failing. The handle may have broke, but I've never heard of a head disintegrating, even a crappy Harbor Freight hammer. So if you're out there and you're worried about the quality of your hammer to being a smith work, that is not the case. You can get any hammer that you like, clean it up and it should do you an excellent job if you buy a blacksmith's hammer you're buying it because it came from somebody's shop and you're paying for the name and the effort they personally put into it